to show you a uh, project that we just finished here at Covert Concepts. It's for a museum up in Chicago, uh, and I think it turned out really, really good. And we want to highlight a couple features on it that uh, we think turned out even even better than what we uh, could have ever hoped for. Uh, Mike, do you want to show them how the the iris works? Yeah. So there's a motor, and it will control uh, the iris opening and closing. And, it's, and inside the iris, when it opens, there's going to be a mechanism in there with a uh, Edison-type bulb, and it's going to flash a countdown. And when it counts down to zero, this will be open all the way, and then this planetary gear system will turn, and all these rods will retract out of the socket that's built up in here. Go ahead and retract it again. And then once that does its full rotation, the next system of motors are going to start, and that's going to turn the uh, number 40 chain and sprocket system that I built from the very back. So you can see how that moves. So also, um, at the museum, they won't be able to put their hand through here. There will be a piece of glass, um, and we're not going to put that glass in here for shipping in case it breaks. But um, it's going to be shipped out this next Monday, and we're really excited to see what the customer is going to say about it. And uh, I can't wait for, uh, for him to give me that call to, to kind of uh, let me know what he thinks. Mike? Yeah, it was a real fun project, a way to be creative and just try to figure out how, to, how do you actually make take something that's not metallic looking and make it look like old rusted metal. That was where I kind of came in and had a lot of fun just experimenting with different techniques and different things to finally give it the, the finished and overall effect of rusted iron and rusted steel without actually being constructed out of rusted iron or rusted steel. But yeah, just, just to let you guys know, the only thing that's metal on this door is the outside frame and these hinges, because they have to be for uh, stability. stability. But all of this back here is all lightweight, expandable PVC sheets. The only thing metal are the bolts and then these aluminum rods and the leaves that go into the iris. But everything else on here, it looks like casted rusted steel, but it's all PVC plastics. Really, really kind of easy material to work with, and I really enjoyed doing it. And it's a lot less weight than um, traditional steel door as well. So that kind of wraps it up, and I think, uh, I think we did a pretty good job. Can't wait to, can't yeah. wait to see it done in, right. in its museum in Chicago. Yeah. All, it? all right, looks good. Yep.